Hi, I'm here to do a ukulele tutorial of Tarot by Alt-J um, because quite a lot of people asked how to do it. I'll put a link to the chords in the description so that you know which chords come where but in terms of the strumming that's what I'm trying to explain to you and I hope that it's coming through. So to start with, the ukulele version of Tarot that I'm playing consists of two sequences of four chords. The first four chords are D minor C, G minor, and F. And the second four chords are C minor, G minor, B flat, and F. Okay, so once you know those four chords and you're able to play them, you can basically play the whole song. So I used a plucking pattern for the first two verses and only strummed during the choruses which are the bits that have no words. How about I just play it through and I'll explain as I go and just see if you can learn from what I'm telling you. So the first two lines go like this. Indo China Kappa jumps G to V creep up the road The beats go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And I pluck on one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I was playing the chords on the neck, but just plucking certain strings that I wanted to pluck. For the D minor chord, the strings that I pluck are C, E, G string, and then for the C, chord, you play the same same string, C, E, G string. So for the first two chords, C, E, G string, C, E, G string. And then for the G minor and F chords, I play the C, E, A string. C string, E string, A string, C string. And that's pretty much it for the first four chords. That's all you need to do, and you just repeat it throughout the song. Kind of getting the gist of it, it's like a one, two, three, 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 one, two, three. Let's try it, shall we? I'll do it at half speed for you. E So once we get to their answers does his chance oh, 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 oh that O is a different sequence of chords, which is the second sequence. You're doing the same timing uh, as you did before, the one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, you doing that again. Um, just different chords. So you're doing all these chords on the bottom three strings, C, E, and A string. You go C minor, like like so, and then you go C string, E string, A string, and then you go G minor, C string, E string, A string. It's a bit of a rough move from C minor to G minor, so that just takes practice to do it really fast. And then after that, same same rhythm, just B flat, C string, E string, A string, and F, C string, E string, A string. So that all together sounds like. And that's it. That's all you really need to know. Once you put it together, it sounds like. Oh, 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 oh,
flash. And when you get to flash, you go back to D minor on the C, E, A strings. Very yellow at flash. So until you get to from medic from golic, that's the C minor, the second sequence again. From medic from golic, friend enemy for him five yards from his leg from you tarot. And when you get back to tarot, go back to D minor sequence is muscle memory so once you practice these stringy things then it's just it, it's just practice you just gotta remember which chords are going where and stuff so for me once I get to do not spray into eyes I just do a single strum of C minor do not spray into eyes and then go straight to B flat, skip the G minor. I have sprayed you. And then F into my eyes. And then for that bit, you just kind of strum however sounds right to you. I do this weird one where it's like. to the next verse it's the exact same thing you go three ten pm gabba bends death quivers last round his last jokes we'll call the gas clears to gray and then It's pretty much the same thing until the end, um, and we get to Do not spray into eyes, I have sprayed you into 